What's up guys, Daquan Kush here with some more 76ers, my gym. It's been a sh uh, very long time since we recorded this, um, but we're back with it. Um, we made a trade, and ever since I made this trade, um, apparently our team is trying to make a playoff run. We gave away Nick Stauskas and Elton Brand. Elton Brand was okay, but he was about 700 years old. And uh, Nick was a starter. We had him starting because I wanted Jared to come off the bench to help improve with scoring and stuff. Um, so yeah, he was a starter. And he was just sucking it up. He averaged probably five points a game when I played. He was terrible. So I ended up trading him for a guy named Tyler Johnson, who's a shooting guard, and Udonis Haslam, who's also kind of an old bastard, but not too shabby. But Tyler Johnson, this guy must be a legend. He must, this must be, I've never played a game with him. I didn't even know he existed, but he's a beast. He's like 23, I think, and, he's, and his shooting stats are insane. And as you guys can see, this is the last game we played. I simmed the rest, but look at all these W's. Like we lost to the Heat, 95, they're 90 to 75, but then we got a nice win streak here. Won 86 70 against the Timberwolves, beat the Celtics 77 72, beat the Rockets 81 77, lost to the Grizzlies by a lot, 92 61. Then we beat the Lakers 76 69, lost, got killed by the Knicks 69 91, lost to the Nuggets 80 to 74, and then we won. Look at this win streak, six games, man. We beat the Spurs 95 86, beat the Nets. 104 to 84 beat the Pistons 82 to 75 beat the Raptors 90 89 beat the Bulls 89 63 and beat the Hawks 77 to 62 and these aren't some ass teams these are some beast teams like the Spurs that's a beast team Toronto amazing team Chicago's a good team as well as the Hawks are a good team too so somehow some way we are getting shit done when we're simming so this Tyler Johnson trade could have been legendary and we're positive look we're 15 and 12 now we're sixth in the conference if playoffs started now, we're in easily. Like, it's crazy. Um, but some things did happen through the sim. I think Covington got injured. He had a hyper-extended hyper knee, so he's out for a uh, week or two. But I decided to make him play through it, and obviously it's working because we're winning. So that's always good. I think he's just getting through the injury, so that's nice. And J.R. Smith is pissed at the world because he wants to start. So I've been giving him, like, pep talks and shit, telling him, like, dude, you can't be a pussy. Take one for the team. We need you to come off the bench. Uh, we need the scoring off the bench, and so yeah, he's pretty mad at me. So hopefully it doesn't, uh, hopefully it doesn't uh, cost me later on. And this is gonna be my first game with Tyler Johnson as the starter. Apparently, th let me just check the box score. Where is he at? 16 points. So that's nice. Let's check over here. Is that, what's he got? Ooh, nine. Not too, not too good there. That's what about this game. Where is he? Am I drunk? Six? How how is this guy man, this guy must just be a legend on defense or something, man. Six again? This guy just must I don't know how we're winning so much with him being asked. Maybe just everyone hated Nick. But anyways, we're gonna play the pussy Knicks. They kinda suck cock. Even though we did get killed by them this game, they kinda suck cock. Um, so let's see if we can get another win. Let it fly. Oh my his release is fast. Get in there. Ah! Uh-oh. There we go. Look at the D. No, don't let him shoot. That's two points. Can't leave that noob open. Get in there, Kevin. Get in there. Money. Oh, let's go. <sighs> Alright. No Carmelo. Just anyone but Carmelo needs to get the ball. Because Carmelo is the only one scoring pretty much. All right, this pussy. No, no, Carmelo. No. Oh, Jesus. Oh, how, man, how did I not steal that? Oh, good D. No way. You better get that board. There we go. Wide open. Oh, you see a little deep, though. We'll, we'll set up the offense. A little deep. He's open again. Oh, right by him. Oh, my God. And he's hurt, man. He's still beasting when he's injured. Got a cheeky little steal. I was trying to get my subs in. Nice little steal, though. I'm not going to lie. Okay, Kevin in the corner. Perfect release. There we go. I was trying to pump fake it and get your shit. No way. What a finish, man. Aaron Aflalo. Holy queef. How did he just score that? That was nasty. Good God. Should have just pulled up right there. 
I think. I think I had him. Oh, that's money. No way. God, why every time I do a step back with him? So ass. My boy JR is a mean step back, man. All right, there we go. D up, D up. Mayday, help me out. Mid get, dude. We got to box out, guys. Come on. This is so fucked. JR. <laughs> oh, boy. This is rough. This is rough. And it's going to be N1. Oh, my God, dude. Jesus, they're starting to run away with it. Okay, this is looking nice. Can Grant finish it? There we go. Post for him. Thank you. Don't want him to shoot a wide open shot, though. Come on. We're not, I wanted to close the half out strong. I didn't want to choke. God, JR is getting going to get fucked here. I already can tell. Wow. Maybe not. Run, JR. Run. Cross. Whoop. Back to the pussy. Okay, did not work at all. Mayday. Mayday, I need I need a screen. JR, make something happen. Get to the hoop or something, dude. Oh. Alrighty. Alrighty. We'll uh we'll get some uh we'll take some free throws. Why not? Why not? You know, only the come on, make this pussy. Get in there, get in there. Alright. Down by six. Not too bad. It was getting worse. We were down by like twelve, I think, at one point. Which was terrible, but Carmelo's going off, and we have no one to stop him because Covington's like our main small forward. We don't, Grant's a little iffy, and Covington's playing on an injury, and he's minus like nine over in overall right now. So it's rough. Like we need him to get healthy. So uh, we'll see what the halftime guys got to say though. It's the 2K Sports halftime show. Hello again, everybody. Ernie Johnson here alongside Kenny, the Jet Smith, and Shaquille O'Neal. We'll be looking back at the game's first half. A stellar first half for Carmelo Anthony. He ended up with 17 points, two steals, and two assists. The first two quarters went very well for him. Taking a look at the Knicks, Kenny, what'd you think? And over to Shaq, what did you think about Philadelphia? Well, they could be ahead in this game if they were taking care of the boards. More possession means more scoring opportunities. A few rebounds either way could decide the outcome of the game. Ultimately, this game will come down to who wants it more. And that'll do it for now as we send you back to Kevin Harlan for the start of the second half. Well, that was a pretty time show. Nothing really exciting. Kind of just it was really short, it seemed like. But oh well, we'll see how we can do this half. Good D, Kevin. Oh my God, how did he score that, man? This poor Z poor Zingas is insane. Guys, one crazy bastard, man. Carmelo, there's no way. Like this game's fake. No way, Carmelo's playing defense. No way, no way, dude. Carmelo does not play defense in this in real life, dude. He just plays offense. He's a pussy. Look, dude. It's difference. Joe, oh, wide open. No, I wanted Jr. Yes, come on, get in there. No way. And you didn't get. Oh boy. This is not looking good at all, man. Get out of here, Carmelo, dude. No way. Why is he so good? God damn it. Right by everyone, man. Foul me. Yes. Oh, my queef. Oh, my queef. Ish, you are amazing. Come on. Get in there. Yes. Okay, D up. Kelvington. I know this is a very tough task for to ask for you, bud, but you got to somehow stop Carmelo. Please. Just don't make it, make it hard for him. No way. And then they go back and get an and one. What am I seeing? We just gonna end one, looking like we're gonna get some momentum, and then this shit. Cut, Grant, do something, buddy. Uh oh, that's a choke. It's a choke. Mayday. Come on, Jr. God damn it. 
shots for them beyond the three point line. We've got we don't score here, then this is looking not good. Oh, wrong button. I thought the guy cutting was I thought the guy cutting was Joe. I didn't know that was Udonis. They look the same haircut. I'm not gonna lie. No th oh god, do not let him shoot a three. Jesus. No threes. Whatsoever. Come on, Covington. Oh boy, it's gonna be oh boy. As I say no threes, and he just drains one. Anthony's got thirty four. 34 points from Carmelo. All right, so that's going to be game. We're going to lose 107 to 94. Pretty rough result at home. Um, I'll talk about why I think we lost um, after the end of the game. We're going to do the little, you know, play of the game shit. So we, I shall talk afterwards, and uh, you guys can hear these pussies for now. Thank you, Kevin, and now let's move on to the presentation of our Jordan player of the game, Carmelo Anthony. Just a monster first quarter of the game. He came out hot and just never cooled down. That boost he gave his team early on a huge factor. We've seen so many performances like that over the course of Carmelo Anthony's career that we've gotten spoiled. But we shouldn't fail to appreciate what he has been able to do tonight. He was spectacular. When he doesn't try to do too much, Carmelo Anthony is absolutely lethal, and he had it going tonight. You know what, Ernie? I must admit it. I didn't see this kind of performance come from him tonight. He's been coming off a stretch of game where he just looked lost out there. To see him turn around this quickly, it's a nice surprise. Play after play, he was getting after it, making plays, and making it look easy. And that brings us to the end of our broadcast for this evening. For Kenny Smith, Shaquille O'Neal, Kevin Harlan, and our illustrious 2K Sports crew, this is Ernie Johnson saying good night, and we'll see you again soon, but not soon enough. Oh, well, pretty much you guys saw Carmelo just absolutely obliterated me. Um, I'm going to have to blame it on Covington just because his injuries, you know, were really rough playing with him injured, you know. He's super slow, and, yeah, so it's kind of rough. I tried not playing him that much, but then I had to put it. Then my next result was either Grant on him, who's okay, and, or JR. So it, Carmelo just destroyed me. It was rough playing with him injured. Um, but this this could be a, one of the best trades I've ever made this in the, in the season. Like, I know the J.R. Smith and Kevin Love trade is pretty godly, but this could be better because... I know most of my games are probably going to be simmed. Like, I'll play, like, maybe, I don't know, 30% of them, but there's a shit ton of games. So, probably 70 to 60% are going to be simmed. Um, so, this, I mean, first game ever playing with him, and he got 19 points. He's not too bad. He's, this guy's not too bad. He shoots kind of weird, but he's not too bad. Kevin Love started off amazing, then started sucking cock. Jill did pretty uh, decent ish, did pretty decent. But other than that, J.R. Smith was absolutely garbage. Look at that. One for 10. Um, not good. Covington. Four points, like, well, not good, and yeah, so, pretty rough, pretty rough, not that much scoring, it looks like, it wasn't, wasn't that good, um, look at Carmelo's, you can see Carmelo just smacking me with 39, that has to be the reason why, like, the only reason why I lost, I probably would have beat him, because I, was I wasn't doing too bad, but Covington, if he was, if I had to sub him out, Grant would be in, and Grant would just get blown by, or Carmelo would do some post fade on him, or the JR, he'd just mess him up, it was just rough. Um, but we're going to fall to 15 and 13. I, I mean, I thought we are going to be getting up one of the top picks, but we're doing we're not doing too bad right now. We are not doing too bad. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, though. If you did, make sure to subscribe, like, and comment, and I will see you in the next one.